it's Nicole Skies. Welcome back to my channel. If you are brand new, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and become a member of the Sky Squad. If you are already subscribed, be sure to turn on those notifications by clicking that little bell. Today we are going to be making an aquarium, but with slime, like full of slime. Like instead of water, the aquarium is going to be slime. It's gonna be super cool. I'm super excited. Let's just jump right in to the video. Uh, excuse me, that was, a, that was a very miniature burp. Oh and hey, if you wanna see me feed miniature food to my quails, go check out my vlog channel. We recently changed the name to Sky's Family. So yeah, I will leave that link in the description, but don't leave yet. Watch the video first and then you can leave. All right, so I made three batches of clear slime that's colored. As you can see, this one is more like aqua and I think this one's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to touch it. Look at it, so, look at that color. That's my favorite color in the world. Oh my gosh, I just wanna be a mermaid and jump in this and live there forever. Okay, bye. Then we have some ocean blue. So this is like ocean, this is like blue lagoon. And then this is also ocean. I'm curious to see, hopefully this fills my fish tank by, by itself. Um, I have some stuff down here that we'll get to later. So I do have a large fish tank that we're going to be filling up. We're actually gonna be making SpongeBob's house, but before that, oh my God, look what I found. This is like, it couldn't be more perfect. This was literally the most perfect thing I found for this video. It's a miniature aquarium and it has all the fish in there and it has a net and a sand castle and plants and it has an aquarium with a background. So yeah, we're gonna be filling this one up first. So I'm gonna snap my fingers and all of this will be unpackaged. So let's go. Whoa, oh my God. So as I was unboxing this on the back, there's this really creepy doll. This looks like Annabelle or something. Rink, rink, rink. I would not wanna be this girl's fish. Mm, girl, you need to get your eyebrows microbladed because what are those? So it looks like there's little notches in this and I think that that's how like the fish are supposed to stay in there because I was curious about that. So as you can see, this has a little notch. I'm just going to put that in the back. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so awesome. And over here, we'll put our green one. Oh, I love it. Hmm, the sandcastle doesn't have any notches. Oh, and then we got our shell. We'll put the shell. Oh my gosh, my hands are too big for this. So here's our shell. And now we have a starfish. Oh my God, I love this. All right, now I'm gonna add my fish. Now we have a clownfish. And then I don't know what this fish is called. Leave in the comments down below. I think this is a yellow, tang, a yellow tang. Yeah, I'm not for sure though. Let me know in the comments down below. And then finally, I don't even know, is this based off a, is this a blue tang supposed to be? Oh my gosh, that looks super cool. I like this. Then we have a treasure box over here. A sand castle. I think if I put the sand castle in there, it's gonna ruin the fish, like the view from the fish. We have some fish food because you know, these, these fish gotta eat, okay? And we also have a net. All right, so I'm going to put my tank on the stand. And let's poke some slime and then add some slime inside our aquarium. All right, so here is my slime. I haven't poked it yet. Oh my gosh, is it gonna stick to me? I don't know, I made this like two weeks ago. Oh. I made that one. Oh yeah, you did make that one. Good job, Jay. It doesn't stick. Awesome. Oh my gosh. It's really cool. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a big blob and put it in the aquarium, so. Are you ready? I'm just gonna blob it in there. Oh, <gasps> that looks so cool. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, I'm getting slammed on the front. I'm trying to get as least bubbles as I can, but I think that's not gonna work. So we'll just pretend that this aquarium, oh my gosh. Okay, so here is my fish tank currently. Now I'm going to let this sit for however long it takes to clear these bubbles. So I might come back tonight, I might come back tomorrow. I'm eating um, a Swedish fish right now too, which is why my mouth sounds full. All right, so as you can see here, I bought a fish tank. So let's open it up. Here's the lid. 
Here's the container, and honestly, guys, I personally do not think that a 1.5 gallon aquarium is big enough to keep any fish, so that's just my opinion. Um, so yeah, I probably wouldn't buy this for fish, just for fun if you wanna make a slime aquarium. All right, so here is my aquarium. I think this looks pretty nifty. It also came with a filter, an LED light, which I, that'll look so cool. Oh my gosh, the light goes up there. That's pretty cool. Um, and then what's in this? I think this is for the light. Yeah, this is the adapter for the light. The Whisper Bio Bag. So that must mean this filter is super quiet. It doesn't make a lot of sound. Also, you guys, I made my betta fish his dream home. I wouldn't put my betta fish in this. If you wanna go watch that, you can check it out. I will leave the link in the description. It's on my vlog channel. All right, so I'm just going to take off the lid and put my aquarium gravel in there. Oh my gosh, those look like nerds. It's making me hungry. Oh my gosh, before we add the plants, let's add SpongeBob. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Wow, there's SpongeBob. Looking all grainy. This is not a very high quality SpongeBob. But SpongeBob needs a house, so let's give him a house. Pineapple house, up here. Whoa. Oh my gosh, wait, that was not the right pineapple that I was trying to get. Let's try that again. Pineapple house, boom. That, perfect. Perfect baby, there it is. So we have SpongeBob and his house, so we're gonna be making a SpongeBob's layer. So let me just add a little sponge in there, little square pants, and his pineapple house. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Now I will add some plants. Hmm, which one should we use? Here we go, where should we put it? Behind his house, I think. All right, so SpongeBob's house actually moved to like a kelp farm and we just have a lot of plants in there. All right, so here is my beautiful aqua teal slime. You are so beautiful to me. What are you sticking to? All right, so here is my beautiful slime. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. That is a little imperfection I got from the freaking saran wrap. It's poking time. Oh. Oh my gosh, this feels so nice. Ooh. Awesome. All right, we are going to basically just pour it in to SpongeBob. Are you ready? I am so excited for this. Give this video a big thumbs up if you are super excited to see this too. Oh, oh my gosh. That's so, oh my God. Yes, boy. Yes. Dude, get up here, get up here, get this view. Look at it covering. So cool, oh my gosh. What's happening to the plants? But I'm not gonna have enough slime to fill up the top. I'm gonna have to use my darker slime. So far, that looks so cool. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. All right, so now I'm going to have to pour some of my darker slime in there. We're gonna make like an ombre, reverse ombre look. Oh my gosh. Why are you so satisfying and beautiful? I can't. Ooh. Ooh, shiny. Ooh. That's so pretty. Can you see me through it? Hi. Let me see. Hey. No, get your whole face in there. Hi. Turn, go this way a little bit, like, to be like vertical with it. Ooh. Yeah. Looks cool. <laughs> it's going to the top. Another one's coming out of the rocks. Oh my gosh, the bubbles. It's a bubble race. Who's gonna win? Whoa. Look, it went there. It's inside. That's that bubble. Oh my gosh, look, yeah. it's gonna go yeah. up. The bubbles rising. Oh my gosh. 
Whoa. That's so cool. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Oh! Whoa. All right, Sky Squad, now it's the challenge part of this video. Screen cap your favorite part of my video and tag me in it on Instagram, and I will be liking your picture. I want you to comment down below. Oh my God, Nicole, I can't believe you bought a real jellyfish. That's gonna confuse people and they're gonna go, what, where did Nicole buy a real jellyfish? assorted fish that I will be adding to Spongebob's aquarium. Now if you can see, the darker blue did make it a little dark. You know, it looks like Spongebob has a storm coming over his house, so you can barely see the pineapple. But if it was all that aqua blue color, it would have looked amazing. All right, so I'm just going to stick a fish on here and I'm gonna squish it down. I have no idea if this is gonna work or how this is gonna look, but Whoa. All right, I want the fish right there. It looks like a shark. He's gonna be really low by SpongeBob. I can't really see him. You have to use your imagination. And now we have some trolley octopuses. We'll pretend these are the jellyfish SpongeBob likes to catch. He needs a net, put his net in there. Oh my gosh, yeah, let's put the net in there. He's catching jellyfish by his house. Are you guys ready? I'm going to try and put this net by SpongeBob. All right, there's SpongeBob's net. It's a little bit bigger than him. And here's a jelly. Looks like a spider. That looks cool. It looks like the shark is going to really attack him. Oh my gosh, it does. That's super cool. All right, we're gonna put one more jelly in here. All the way down. I like when I push it down, all his arms are up. But then when I go like this, I push all his arms down. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with how this turned out. Okay guys, so I added my top light. On, off, on, off. Now let's see what it looks like. That's with it off. And that's with it on. You can kind of see the pineapple a little bit better. Oh my gosh, my squid fell all the way to the bottom. So yeah, see you can see the pineapple now. It's starting to look like bikini bottoms. Super cool. All right, Sky Squad, so I'm super excited about how this turned out, but I'm not going to be taking it out and mixing it today. I'm, I'm gonna let it sit and clear up, and then in my next slime smoothie video, I'm going to be taking it out and adding it to a slime smoothie, so that's gonna be super fun. And we will be mixing this one in the slime smoothie as well. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big fat thumbs up. Go check out my Sky's Family vlog channel posting daily over there. So if you wanna see more content from me and my Sky's Family, the link will be in the description down below. I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.